What's going on, my crazy coupon family? I've got your CVS haul for the deal starting March 8th. And you guys, I know I said it on my Walgreens haul video, but I, it feels so good to be back into the swing of things. I'm feeling a lot better. But you know what's going to be even better? This coming Sunday when I'm going to have this haul videos done and posted before y'all even head to the store early Sunday morning. You guys know I'm out all night long, Saturday night, the night before. Couponing into the wee hours of Sunday morning. And actually, it honestly works a lot better for me to do it that way than to try and do it in the middle of the week. When I have to do these deals videos in the middle of the week, this is just kind of putting me even farther behind. But anyway, what have you? If you're not part of the Crazy Deals and Steals family yet, go ahead and subscribe now and hit that notification bell. One of the reasons you need to, need to hit that notification bell is that we are doing a live cash app giveaway this coming Friday, March the 13th at 7.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. So I don't want you guys to miss that. We will be doing um, random questions and things like that for cash cash app giveaways. We're also doing our regular gift card giveaway at that 10,000 subscriber mark. So be sure to stay tuned for that. And if you have not already, y'all need to start following us on Instagram for not only all the deals F Academy is posting for you guys throughout the week that I can't make videos for, but for things like my massive penny haul that I had today by chance, you guys might want to check that out. So be sure to also follow us on Instagram. That information is right here. And now back to the CBS haul, you guys, if I calculated everything correctly, all these items right here ended up being about a $13 moneymaker. Now, when I say $13 moneymaker, that means after what I paid out of pocket, including extra bucks, if I used extra bucks to pay out of pocket, that's included in what I pay out of pocket. I don't consider the extra bucks to be just free coupons or whatever, because they're not, it's, it's CVS money. So after everything that I paid in cash and extra bucks out of pocket, minus all the extra bucks I got back, fetch points I got back, I bought a rebates I got back. This haul right here is about a $15 moneymaker. We've got Pampers, we've got paper products, we've got hand soap, we've got makeup, we've got dental whitening kits. We got all kinds of great stuff. So let's get into it right now. Okay, let's start with this fabulous transaction right here. All of these items that you see right here were in one transaction. So instead of splitting them all up, what I did was I looked at my purchase based CRTs. And what I mean by that is, what CRTs do I have for these items right here that are like a $3 off $15 Huggies purchase or a $2 off $8 paper product CRT? Something like that where it's a amount off a certain priced purchase. And I added that up. And then I said, would it be more beneficial for me to use a $10 off $50 CRT because I had one of those. And it turned out to be more beneficial for me to buy these items and use that 10 off 50 CRT and no other purchase based CRT. So that's exactly what I did. Um, so the Huggies, I paired in a couple of different promotions, um, three, I think. So the Huggies and the Scott and the Lysol over here, those are part of a spend $30 and get a $10 extra care buck back. So the Huggies are two for 20. The Lysol is buy one, get one half off and they are $2.89 a piece. So one was $2.89. The other one was half of $2.89. And then the, let's see, 20, the Scott paper products, I believe, oh gosh, were these $5.49? I think these were $5.49. Um, cause there was a pack that was $7.99 and yeah, I believe these are $5.49. So two for 20, buy one, get one half off and then $5.49 for the Scott. And then these babies right here were four for $10. And when you buy $10 worth, you get a $5 extra care buck. So I went ahead and grabbed these. This baby right here was $2. And when you buy one, you're going to get a $1 extra care buck back. This baby right here was just on clearance. It was marked down to $10.99, so it was a little bit over, I believe, half off. Um, and I had a few CRTs for this that we're going to talk about here in just a second, all right? So let's start with the Huggies. I used manufacturer coupons for the Huggies, a $2 manufacturer for this one and a $2 manufacturer for this one back here. Those came out of our paper on that we got on this past Sunday. Scott Paper Towels, I used a $1 printable from scottbrand.com. No coupons, you guys, for the soft soap, but if you have not printed these soft soap hand soap coupons from softsoap.com yet, you can certainly print those and use four 50 cent coupons for these items right here. All right. I don't think they have a limit. I think you can use four of them. 
but I printed from that website so many times that I cannot print any more for these right now, but I don't have any more of these left in my stockpile, so I needed to get these anyways, okay? The deodorant, no coupon for the sure, okay? No coupon for this one. The Lysol, I used a 50 cent manufacturer coupon from one of our recent papers for each one of these Lysols. And this baby right here, I had $3 CRTs for this. I actually had three of them and all the serial numbers uh, were different. So I should have been able to use all three. They were all $3 off CVS teeth, white, teeth whitening kit or treatment. Since the barcode serial numbers were different on those CRTs, I should have been able to stack all of them together on this one item. However, only two of them were stacking. So I should have gotten $9 off of this $10.99 purchase. However, I only got um, $6 off. So that weighed into my out of pocket a little bit, but that's okay, still a fabulous price. And I'll be able to turn around and sell this for probably 12 bucks. I'll list it for sale for $12, okay? <clears throat> so all these items right here, put me right at about $50 before coupons. I might've been a little bit under 50, but that's okay because that store followed the 98% rule, okay? So like I said, I use that 10 off 50 CRT. I also use a dollar and 50 cent off any Lysol products. It was not a dollar and 50 cent off $5 Lysol, nothing like that, just a dollar and 50 cents off. So those you can stack with those purchase based CRTs, okay? So I use that CRT for these Lysols in this purchase as well. And the rest of what I did was stacked a whole bunch of extra bucks to lower my out of pocket, you guys. And let me tell you, I paid 31 cents cash out of pocket. I'm gonna let you guys see my receipt real quick. But guess what? So with all my extra bucks, I paid it 20, I'd added it all up. Um, I paid $29 out of pocket. That's all the extra bucks I used to pay. So I paid $29 in extra bucks out of pocket, but I got back a $10 extra care buck for buying $30 worth of select products that we talked about. I also got back a $5 extra care buck for the soft soap, a $1 extra care buck for the sure, and it does not stop there, you guys. I got back 3,000 fetch points for each one of these packs of pull-ups. That is $3 back on fetch for each pack. So I got back $6 on fetch for buying these Huggies pull-ups, and it doesn't stop there. I also got a dollar back on Ibotta for buying these pull-ups right here, as well as 75 cents back on fetch for buying these Scott paper towels, these babies right here, all right? So we're looking at getting $23.75 back. So I paid $29 in extra bucks out of pocket, and I got back $23.75 in either extra bucks, fetch points, or I bought a rebates, okay? So what's that mean? That means this whole entire transaction right here ended up being $5.25 for all of these items you see right here. This is how you coupon. You get the most bang for your buck, you utilize our rebate apps, you utilize your extra care bucks to pay down your out of pocket, and you utilize your CRTs the way that they work best for you, okay? So we're talking about $5.25 for all of these items, and that even includes the tax on my receipt, okay? So we're looking at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I've got 11 items, you guys. Five bucks for 11 items? Yes, okay, that is less than what, 50 cents an item? That is fantastic, and look, we've got the pull-ups and we've got the Scott products, we've got the Lysol, the hand soap, all of these things will be resold in bundles and I will quadruple what I paid out of pocket for. All right, these are the items right here that I decided to pair for my $20 off $100 select personal care makeup um, product CRT that everyone got at CVS this week. It didn't quite go as planned. Anything I wanted to try and pair with this, they either didn't have or I didn't have the right coupons or it was priced wrong. So anyway, I did the best that I could. Um, we're gonna talk about it. So. The L'Oreal L Vive is $4.99 each. Buy two, get a $5 extra care buck. And we've got insert coupons, um, $4 off two insert coupons. So then I did the Garnier, two for seven. And when you buy two, you're gonna get a $3 extra care buck. And we also have a $3 off two insert coupon from the Retail Me Not for these. She missed scanning that coupon. It is not on my receipt anywhere. So CVS owes me three bucks. Keep a tally, you guys. Now for the Jergens, it is $7.99, and we've got a $3 off manufacturer coupon for that. And when you buy one, you're gonna get a $2 extra care buck. 
And then the Alme is on a spin 12, get a $4 extra care so buck. So spin 12, get a $4 extra care buck, but it's a limit of six. So I did that deal twice in one transaction. So that way, instead of getting $4 in extra care bucks back, I got $8 in extra care bucks back because these two items were $6.49 each. And then I think this baby was like $8.29, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and then this was a similar price, Rock ate it. <laughs> so, you whoopsies. Um, okay, so that's for the Alme. And then the Maybelline is buy two, get a $7 extra care buck. These are $4.19 at my store. These little single quads right here, and we have $1 coupons from coupons.com. So I used one of those, and then one from the paper. They are a limit of one. So I used one from the paper and one from coupons.com. Then the CoverGirl is buy two get a five dollar extra care buck so these babies right here were i believe 6.29 at my store and i used three dollar smart source manufacturer coupons for each one of these items right here the userin is on a spin 20 get a ten dollar extra care buck again so for the userin i decided to grab these smaller ones they are included and the coupon will work for these there is no size limit on one of those userin coupons so i grabbed two of the small ones for I think six seventy nine or five seventy nine, six seventy nine maybe five seventy nine, and then one of the bigger ones. This one was eight ninety nine, um, so I hit that twenty dollar mark for that. So all these items right here equaled about a hundred dollars. I'll show you guys my receipt. I will tell you that CVS owes me a three dollar off to manufacture coupon for this. They owe me three dollars and extra bucks for that one. And they also owe me the CRTs that everyone printed last week that I could not print because the machine was down. And that was a um, $2 off to L'Oreal L5 that I'm gonna get back from them. So now we're up to them owing me five bucks. And also a $3 Maybelline CRT that everyone got last week that I couldn't get because the machines were down. So they owe me $8, CVS owes me eight bucks. So what I ended up doing was I paid a total of $43 out of pocket that included all of these extra bucks and that money I paid in cash right here, that's about 43 out of pocket, but I got back $40 in extra care bucks, not including all the beauty money. I'm going to get back probably about $9 back if I counted it right in beauty point or beauty bucks. So getting back $49, I paid 43, get back 49, but keep in mind CVS owes me, um, four, five, six, seven, eight dollars so if you want to calculate that in <clears throat> i'll give, be getting back uh 49 let's see got back 40 plus the nine for the beauty that's 49 50 one two three four five six seven so i'll be getting back technically 57 so 43 out of pocket get back 57 quite a money maker for these items right here all right for these right here separate transactions speed stick in one transaction these are the only items i got at that one store i told you guys about on my community tab where the one woman came in and cleared the entire shelves of everything that they had um so i got these we're talking about these first and then i got these other hair care items back here in the back with my other cvs account no i did not clear the shelves with the L'Oreal L5 or the Garnier. They had tons left on the shelf. I also asked the manager. They said they had tons more in the back. So I was like, okay, cool. Had they been low on these items right here, I would have only done that deal with my one CVS account. I would not have done it again, okay? So let's talk about the Speed Stick first. They are $2.99, and when you buy one, you're gonna get a $2 extra care buck. They are a limit of two. So what I did was I went and grabbed two of them, that put me at $6. I used a dollar off to speed stick CRT. That dropped me down to $5. Then I used a $1 off any deodorant CRT. That dropped me down to $4. And I paid with one $4 um, extra care buck. I paid zero with cash. And I got back $4 in extra care buck. So completely free for these items right here. I was actually looking for the women's. But of course, they didn't have any because the other woman had all of them in their her carts. Okay. So now for the second hair care deal, and I apologize, I forgot to mention on the previous little info for the previous transaction about a glitch going on with the L'Oreal L5. Um, so if you guys have a $3 off to L'Oreal L5 manufacturer digital coupon, go ahead and clip that before you check out with these because it is glitching and coming off with your paper manufacturer coupon, okay? So that's creating a really great money maker. The reason I paired in the Suave with this is because the Suave is on sale two for six. Rock, quit. 
sorry, rocks playing with Pootie. And when you buy two, you're gonna get a $2 extra care buck. I originally just had planned to grab these items, but I wanted to use a $4 off $18 hair care CRT. And these at the store that I was at were $4.99. These are two for seven. So that didn't quite put me at the right amount to use that CRT. So I was like, what hair care item can I add in? This is gonna be beneficial to me to where I can still use that. And I went ahead and decided on the Suave. So for the Suave, the only thing I used for this was a $2 off to Suave. Hair Care CRT, no manufacturer coupons used on this. The L'Oreal l -Vibe, I used a $4 off two manufacturer coupon and that digital $3 off two manufacturer came off as well. And then the Garnier, a $3 off two paper manufacturer coupon for that one right there. So I'm gonna show you guys my receipt. <clears throat> I paid $7 out of pocket, but I got back a $5 extra care buck for the l -Vibe a $3 extra care buck for the Garnier and a $2 extra care buck for the Suave. So this ended up being a $3 money maker for these items right here. All right, my crazy deals and steals family. Now that we have hit this green screen, you're going to see thumbnails right here for other videos on this channel that you should be watching the really phenomenal Walgreens haul with the Huggies box diapers. We've also got the CBS deals video. If you need help pairing deals together, there's other deals on there that I do not have in this haul video. So you want to check that one out. And up next for this channel, we're going to have a Dollar General deals video posted Thursday. CBS and Walgreens deals will be posted Friday. And the CBS and Walgreens haul video will be posted early in the morning Sunday before you guys even head to the store. Please give this video a big thumbs up on your way out and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.